G'day everyone, it is freezing right now, it is currently 3 degrees, so what I thought I'd do is I'd come out with some homemade bait traps, dog food as bait, see if I can catch anything in the freezing weather. Alright, here is our bait, just some dog food from Coles, pick it up anywhere, you can use Goodos, they're the best brand of dog food to use for yabbing or just catching little minnows. Here's the trap, it's basically just an inverted uh, soda bottle or fizzy drink bottle, whatever. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get a handful of this stuff and I'm just going to pour it into here. I reckon that'll be plenty. So hopefully something swims into our little nozzle, gets stuck, and uh, when I come back tomorrow, hopefully there's something in it. Guys, trust me to forget the most important part of the trap, which I have. I have forgotten to get the string so without it if I were to chuck that in it would have just um, sunk to the bottom and been unretrievable so I'm heading home now to go get it I'll be back with you when I got it all right I've got the uh, string I just had to run home it's just attached to um, that thing there which is attached to the stick you see here so that's just I'm just gonna chuck it in uh, right here maybe and we'll see if we can get anything I don't think this will uh, sink, so it's going to float, I bet you. I am correct. I'm just going to have to push it down so that it fills with some water. There we go. There it is, full of water. And down it goes. Goodbye chat. I'll come back check on you tomorrow. Down it goes. I'll feed it some string so it doesn't I want to say starve itself with string, but that's not actually gonna happen. Righty, I'll come back and I'll uh, check it tomorrow. I'll be back in like one second for you. It's 12 hours for me. Rightio guys, it is the next day and it is time to check the traps. Righto, here's the stick that the string is attached to. Let me see if I can find the string. I'm struggling to find it. Oh, there it is. Just there. Rightio. Pull her in. Oh, there's a lot of trash in it. I can definitely 100% see something in it. Let me just pull it out of the water. We have trapped something. I have indeed trapped something. Let me go grab the uh, bucket because you probably can't see anything in that dirty mess. I've got a bucket over here. Here's the bucket. I had uh, fish food in case we didn't find anything. Maybe it was the fish food's fault, but no. Nah. Let's just put a bit of water in the bucket. Okay, now this is the first time I've used this, um, this exact trap. So I'm just going to undo the pins. That one's attached to a string so I shouldn't lose it. This pin. Rightio, things are off. Let's just lift the lid. And I'll see if I can show you it in there. So just on the top there, a little uh, tadpole. It's pretty cool. I'm just going to dump it out into the bucket now. There he goes. Into the bucket. Nothing else in here. Nothing, that was it. Just that and a soggy pile of dog food. Which I'll dump over here just in case there is something. And there's not nothing else in it. Radio. See how cool is that? One tadpole. I'll see if I can get a closer look for you. If this light wants to behave. There we go. Okay, I'm going to release him now. Back to where he came from. There he goes, just like that, gone. 
Rightio, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to reset it just in the water system to the uh, left of me here. It's literally diagonal from the other one. I'm going to put fish food, um, like fish flakes in it this time to see if we can catch any guppies, not just a tadpole. Is the bait here. Just some uh, gold fish flakes. I'm just going to dump some in here. There we go. You don't need too much. I'm just going to put how much in. Can't see if the camera can see it or not because it's sunny. But there we go. Just that much in. The lid goes on and you just put the uh, safety pins in it. This is the uh, final pin with the string on it. I'm just going to put this one in the side. Now it is kind of hard to poke the pins through both layers of plastic, but they get through eventually. Okay guys, I was just not filming. I accidentally didn't hit record. So basically what I did is I got the trap out of there, found a tadpole, put it in there. I'm pretty sure I got that bit on film. But what I didn't get is I uh, actually reset it with some goldfish flakes. And I just put it just in this uh, waterway just here. It's diagonal from the one just over there. And I'm going to leave this in for a couple of hours and I'll come back. It's got fish flakes in it. Maybe that'll catch some more guppies or I'll be surprised to catch a goldfish. Rightio guys, it's been two hours and it's time to check the trap. Here we go. Still can't find the string again. There it is. Oh, I don't think there's anything in here. Oh, it's probably not a good idea to dead weight this up. It's going to snap. Ah, oh, it didn't snap. There is nothing in here. Fish food, not a good bait. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some bread in it this time and I'm going to set it into that big pond bit over there. Leave it in for like another hour or two and I'll come back and uh, check if there's anything. Get some bread, rip it up. I'm just going to shove it down the the nozzle. Okay, it's got to be ripped up more apparently. The small pieces. Now it's still got the scent of fish food on it, so that's not probably good. Probably should have cleaned it out proper. But maybe that'll make the fish come to it. And a little bit of crust, because who, who knows? Who knows why? Okay, that should be probably more than I need. Right, just do a bit of bread there. Let's go chuck it in. I think I'll put it just in the shallow here because I saw some guppies earlier when I was here swimming around just here. Stick in the ground and trap can go in right out there. Where it's got to go. Fill it full of water. Just roll it out there. There it goes. It's just straight down there. Come back in two hours and see if there's anything in it. Rightio, everyone, it has been two hours and I'm going to check the trap for the last time. So here we go. You might not be able to hear in the background, but there was like birds everywhere. Because last I was here, I chucked a ton of bread and just food from everywhere, and now they're everywhere eating. There it is. Up you come. Oh no! No! It snapped. I have to get down there and get that before it sinks. Oh, this water is freezing. Got it, got it. And I don't think we've caught anything. We haven't. We've caught nothing. For the third and final time, but oh, oh, this water is freezing, I'll tell you. It is absolutely freezing. Rightio, guys, thanks for watching. I've had such an awesome afternoon. If you want to know how to make them bait traps I was using, just leave a comment and I'll make a video on how you make them. But thanks for sticking around for the video. If you enjoyed it, leave a thumbs up, subscribe if you're brand new, and I'll catch you in the next one.